we are catching a flight back to Nashville today, and this is the first time we've flown with a dog. Boy, oh, things seem so nervous. Brian just paid and they said he has to be in his crate when we go through TSA. And he is not liking his crate, so this is gonna be interesting. Well, now they just told us we have to take him out of the cage and carry him through security. Ah. Hey everyone, we are in Kansas City and we just picked up our new Gold Adore puppy, Mojo. Say hi everyone, I'm Mojo. <laughs> we live in Nashville now, so we are catching a flight back to Nashville today. And this is the first time we've flown with a dog. So we're gonna share with you our experience of flying Southwest with a dog. Mojo, are you ready to go on an airplane? Are you gonna go on an airplane? Brian's getting everything ready. We have a little crate for him because he's gonna have to go underneath our seat. He is almost nine weeks old, and like I mentioned, he's a gold adore. So he's a golden retriever Labrador mix, and he is just precious. He slept in the hotel room with us last night, and he was awesome. <laughs> Get in there, buddy. Are we just holding him? Mojo, you gotta go in your crate at the airport, buddy. We're going. You first, or you wanna go in first? Not you going in, baby girl. Here goes daddy, short little shuttle ride. Well, Mojo was ride. not wanting to go in the crate, so this is gonna be interesting when we get to the airport. <laughs> you don't need the crate, do you? so good off the leash because he was oh, raised on a farm. <laughs> Things seem so nervous. It's okay. Ah, uh, is he making a friend? So now we have to check in and get him all situated. I think there's like a $95 fee for bringing a dog on board. So he's gotta get paid that and then get through security. Brian just paid and they said he has to be in his crate when we go through TSA. And he is not like in his crate, so this is gonna be interesting. <laughs> Layla is insisting on walking Mojo. Layla, this way. Mojo, this way. Uh-oh, this could take a while. <laughs> yeah, we'll just, you can walk him when we get through security. Time to get him in the crate, putting lots of treats in there. Go get him. Come on, buddy. Go get him. You could do it. Go get him. Get that booty in there. Get that booty. In the tail. Oh, you stubborn boy. Oh my gosh, Layla, he is so stubborn. Yay! It's okay, buddy. Let's give him Buddy, it's just for a little bit. We just gotta get through TSA. <laughs> so, Brian, I think she just said we take him out of the cage and walk through him with him. Well, now they just told us we have to take him out of the cage and carry him through security. <sighs> Layla, you're such a good helper. So that was confusing, Brian. Yes. Brian, I think you got your hands full. Here comes Miss Layla. Was that fun? Brian, I felt like a celebrity. Everyone was ooing and aahing over Layla on the suitcase and Mojo. I was just like, everyone wanted to stop and see us as we were walking through. I took Layla Jane to go get a cake pop at Starbucks and I come back to see Brian surrounded by people all wanting to pet Mojo. He is a ham and loving it. <laughs> Time to board, which means we have to get him back in the crate. <laughs> this is gonna be a disaster again. Good boy, Mojo. You did good. Are you gonna cry the whole time? It's okay. I got you, buddy. I wish we could take him out. I wanna take him out. I've heard it a million times, but we do have to remind you that the mask policy isn't effective the entire flight process. Okay, Brian, what's worse? Mojo crying this whole time or Mojo. when Layla Jane cries? Mojo, without a doubt. <laughs> okay, so the stewardess came and said to put a blanket over his kennel so he can't see out. And that seems to be working. Like a den. Hopefully, yeah, make it like a den. And I think he's gonna, hopefully he'll fall asleep here soon. We made it. We're here in Nashville. Mojo did okay. <laughs> he barked. Depends who you ask. Okay. He barked a lot, but he started again. <laughs> he fell asleep while we were up in the air, which was awesome. Layla did great. She 
just like ate her snack, watched some shows, looked out the window a lot, and she had a blast. Mama. I just can't wait to get him home now. Good job. We're here, buddy. You're free. Oh, there, where's your leash? <laughs> oh, honey. <laughs> He wanted to walk. He's ready to go home, right? You two ready to go home? Aww. We did it. Oh my gosh, look how curly my hair is I already from the humidity. Hurt. If I were giving advice to anyone traveling with a dog, check with your vet first because I know a lot of people do this and they give them like a little medicine or Benadryl. Oops. Something to kind of help them sleep and stay calm. That's something I wish we would have done with him. I just don't know if he was old enough yet. But definitely, that would be my only recommendation. Otherwise, it went really smoothly. It did. He was quite And maybe have place. some bones to put in there with them. Although, he didn't really eat any of his food. But if your dog likes bones and toys, have lots of stuff for him. Let's go. Hey, this is your new home, Mojo. Layla, we got to show Mojo around. Do you want to show him his bed, where his bed is? Yeah. Is it over there? Come on. Come on, Mojo, come see your bed. Oh, no, wait, no, 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 Mojo. Uh-oh, uh-oh. He just peed. <laughs> so obviously not potty trained yet, but perfect because as you can see, we just moved into our house. We have no rugs, furniture, anything. So didn't do too much damage. Good boy, you do pee pee out here now? Good boy, Mojo. Poor guy was holding it for You were holding it. Do you know how to go upstairs? Come on, Mojo. Mojo. Mojo, this way. Mojo, come on, up, buddy. Come here. Uh oh. Do you not know how to do stairs, Mojo? Where is he? Mojo. Mojo. Oh, did you find your toy? Hey, I think you need a bath. I think you need a bath now. Do we do bath? Do you need a bath? Do you need a bath? <laughs> I guess I have to carry you up the stairs. Until you learn how to do the stairs. <laughs> Is it bath time? But who do you want to be in the bath with you? Mojo. You want Mojo, Mojo. Layla wants to take a bath. Let's see. Let's see if he likes water. Well, he jumped in the pond at the original owner's house, so yep. You want to get out? Aw. Oh my goodness. He's strong. Look at that. Well, Layla, you get the bath to yourself. Mojo's too distracted. On our way into PetSmart to get this little dog some toys so he doesn't keep biting or chewing on all of Layla's toys. <laughs> Gotta get the poop bags. Oh, Mojo, I think those bones are a little too big for you right now. Maybe in a few years. A Here's the fun toy. aisle. The toy that makes Yes, sense. he needs a Kong. Layla, what should we get him? The little ball. The little ball, you like that? Do you want to choose something? Okay, which one? You go choose a toy. Oh, a little ball, you're right. You like that? Yes, yes. We'll put one in there. Oh, Mojo, should we get you in an outfit while you're still little? Fashion for dogs. Oh my gosh, so cute. We got some Kongs, uh, Layla, some little mini tennis war? balls. Layla, you can play What's tug of, that? You can play tug of war with them like this. These are puppy treat toys. Oh, perfect, Layla, that'll be fun. Time to make his name tag. I gotta make sure, like, a, um, one that he'll grow into. Oh, yes, perfect. You're gonna get Hilda some little jewelry. Some little jewelry for that collar. Well, Lily Jane got distracted, so I'm with her looking at fishies while Daddy makes his name tag. How's it going over there? Okay. Aw, perfect. All right, are we done? We are done. I think we just couldn't get the food here because they don't carry the brand, but the good thing is, they were giving him a really good small production healthy food that we can find at, a, at a, uh, another pet store and we'll keep him on it. All right, so I guess we'll have to try out some more pet stores, get his food that he likes. 